In this video, we're going to address a very common issue with objects moving too fast that they go through other objects just like you see there. Um, this cube has a script, so when I hit space, it will apply force in the forward direction by 9000. also has a rigid body, so it falls to the ground. This wall has a rigid body and a box collider, both active. And this also has a box collider but no rigid body. So for this, uh, quick test again, I'll hit space. You can see the cube goes right through. So the main cause of this is, well, the white cube itself, the collision detection itself, needs to have a continuous collision detection. And so with it having a, a continuous collision detection, you see that it will now no longer go through this wall. You can see that? We'll do it one more time. And I'll hit space and no longer go through this wall. It just kind of hits up right against it. So why is that working? Is because this wall um, is basically a static collision or it has a static kind of collider on it. So it's not something that is meant to move around. The difference between this one now is that it has a rigid body and so it's kind of like it's meant to move around. So this one you can just set it to static and everything works just as before because now the cube has a continuous collision detection. You see that works just fine. However, now for this one to work properly, um, since your cube has a continuous collision detection, if the other object also has a rigid body on it, so maybe it's a like a bowling game and your ball is going through the pins, um, chances are your pins also have a rigid body on them and so that needs to be set to continuous dynamic. Now if that's the case, when we play, you can see that the cube is still at 9000 and when I hit space, it does not go through the one in front. And I'll play it one more time. You can see that it's not a fluke. And there we go. It does not go through the collision of either one of them. So that's it. Hopefully this helped you um, if you <laughs> were searching for something like this. And I'll catch you in the next one.